Action. I found this floating club of land. I found this clump of sand out of nowhere. Well, I guess we could walk. Oh, oh, oh! This is, is this, this is quicksand. Oh, as you can see from the title, welcome to quicksand in Minecraft. And I am currently drowning, and I'll show you how this works in a few moments. Yeah, this is gonna be, this isn't gonna end well. Yep, you see, you died. So, first I'm gonna get all this, and then I'll show you how to make it. But I was also gonna get so. Okay. So I was messing around with sand a lot, as you can see. So I figured out that watch. Okay, sand falls through cobweb. I did not know this. I don't know if you know this. Don't know if you think I'm being stupid and d just don't know this, and it's just really dumb that I didn't notice. And yeah, the sand does disappear after it does. So boom, it it's falling in cobweb. It's just very sh interesting to my mind. So I've been playing around with this, and I'll show you how to build the thing in a minute. But check this out. It's just so funny. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm laughing like crazy. A lot of stats. I know, look, look. It's just bouncing. Oh, whoops, whoops, whoops. Let me refuel that. Oh my goodness, that was well sent. <laughs> and that wasn't falling in. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Looks like a butt pooping poop. So, sorry about that major um delay. I. It was a delay for us, not for you, because you're watching this. Oh my goodness! It's just dun dun dun! It looks so cool, and it's adding up one by one. Let's look at the hopper. Oh my goodness! That's why. That's why it's not accepting. That's why it's not accepting it. That's why it's not accepting it, because there's so much in the hopper. <laughs> I thought it was on the lip of the hopper, not the hopper. Anyways, on to how to build this. <sighs> um. How to build, number one. Okay, this is how you build it. What you're going to need. You're going to need cobweb. Cobweb. Lava, or lava. any torture device. Sand, Sand, of course. Grass. Grass. Or you could just use the natural spawning grass. Uh, but if you're making this in a desert, you need the grass. Yeah. A two-block high bush, as yeah, I'm using a rose bush. String. String. Sandstone. Sandstone. Or any surrounding block. So, okay. how are you going to build this? Oh, I'm just getting to that. <laughs> so, you're going to do this. It's going to be as big as you want it to be. Awesome. But that means more work. As you can see. Not awesome. Aw. There might... Uh, depending on how much... Um, so, yeah. Depending on how much you use, blah, blah, blah. So, first you're going to start off by putting your roses up on them. Then you put the sand on top of your roses. Then you can surround that sand with the block of your choice. I'm using sandstone because it looks like the sand. And then what you're gonna want to do is that you're gonna put the you're gonna put string on top of it. I know it's not connected to redstone, and that's why you think string is for like trick wire hooks. But um, why do you want to put string? Okay, so the string will actually cause, um, it will still cause a redstone up down the sand. So right here it's kind of like a little glitch. I don't know why it does this. The string will make the sand fall. Oh, I get it now. Okay. So <laughs> that's how it works. Sorry, Drake's just being cuckoo. Drake's being I'm, crazy. I'm the director. Yep. You're my I also have my own channel. Check it out in the description. Okay, so now you're going to place... Are you sure you're going to put it in the description? Probably not, but who knows? Okay. <laughs> I never put anything in the description. So then put your torture device on the bottom. Oh my goodness, no! And then on top of your torture device, you are you can even use command blocks like at P kill or something like that. Dun, dun, dun. And I was like talking to my dad. I was talking earlier with my bro, I think. Was it you, Drake? I don't know. You could even put the void under the cobweb just as an extra killer. What's the void? The void? Welcome to the void, people. <laughs> the void. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's, now I get it. Let's, let's fill the void up with some sand. Is it? Oh, wow, it actually does fall. I thought they stopped at the end of the void. Okay. So then, boom! You sink into this quick sand. 
So a lot of you are probably wondering, hey, I know how to do that, but now how do you do this? It's just so creepy. So what I did, as you can see this in the background, just put set blocks in. Um, this is completely custom. And then 12-0 is the command for sand. And then so it will just keep, I made it so that some sand right there and I'll fall. Go through all this cobweb, it will stop right there and we'll just drop. And this, this just, <laughs> if your chest overflows the sand, there's going to be a lot of sand right here. Just do this. This is a little cool, cool thing you can do with chests. So dig down here, put a hopper right there, and build another chest. And then, as you can see, the sand will fall into the, awesome. right there. the sand will fall into that chest now. And you can just expand that as much as you can. So this chest isn't even full yet, and it's just gonna. Once this chest is full, and this chest will still get filled up. So hope you enjoyed this crazy. Oh my. Wow, there's so much sand in there. Hope you enjoyed this crazy tutorial, and please subscribe and like if you're new to the channel. And thanks for watching. But please watch, it would be awkward if I was talking to myself the whole time. <laughs> Very awkward. Okay, uh, bye. See you later, alligator, I guess. Don't know what I should say now. In closing, uh, be sure to watch, um, oh, I have, a, I have a great idea. Be sure to watch my videos. One second. Click the sand for a magical surprise. If you dare. Open the chest. If you dare. Oh, there's just a bunch of sand in here. Never mind, don't open the chest. <laughs> Click the sand. It's much better than the chest. <laughs>